One of the things I was doing some work on was some video and when you're prompting, you kind of try and figure out where are the limits of the system and where aren't they? And again, we've talked a lot about models. Every model you work with is different. So this is particularly using Kling AI, uh, which is a, comes out of China. So I was prompting it trying to get a llama fighting a cybernetic camel because that's what seemed like to be a good idea at the time. And I could not for the life of me, I could get, whenever I prompt it for a llama, I would get two camels. And I realized something, the data set this was all trained on came out of a data set that would not have the idea of a llama inherent in it. So think about llamas are, are native to North, South America in particular, but they've made a pretty good spread up to North America. So if you ask it for something, the model is not going to know. I thought about something else it might know, thinking about pop culture. So I ask it for a meerkat thinking that's in the Lion King becomes a pretty well-known thing. And I got a very different result when I was trying to ask it for the epic fight. I got an actual camel and I got the meerkat in their cybernetic armor. Now the AI does some weirdnesses and moves stuff back and forth, but it was interesting, right? So this is when you're working with, whether it's a text-based or an image-based or a video-based, where is the data set that this tool is coming from? And what are some of the other constraints or things it's bringing in that you need to consider when you're going up to apply it?